I mean, I got fans. Uh, I got friends that live around here, mm-hmm. family like forty five minutes away. So it's all good. It's yeah. all good. nice. Yeah, we saw that video of uh, you kind of learning that you were coming to Sacramento yeah, over the uh-huh. summer. Uh, it looked like you were you were maybe working out. What yeah, happened kind of immediately after that camera turned off uh, and and everything was settled? Well, I talked to my agent or whatever. Yeah. Found out I was really getting traded, and I was back to working out. Man, honestly. Mm-hmm. Uh, I was like, yeah, we done. Like my trainer was like, nah, like we still got more to do because <laughs> yeah. they had stopped the workout for like 15 minutes. I'm like, oh, so we done. He's like, nah. yeah. So that's all I really have. Talk to my agent. And yeah. Nice. Yeah. Jalen, coming from Toronto, you're going to get a bit of a fresh start here yeah. in Sacramento. And, you know, Trey Lyles, we just talked to Trey with his groin injury. There's one thing that we've been asking for in Sacramento, and that's mm-hmm. wings. So okay. to get somebody like you out here, does it feel like you, you're getting a bit of a fresh start and an opportunity to show yeah, what you can sure. do? Uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, it's a brand new, fresh start, you know, I'm excited about it. Glad to be here. Um, I just can't wait to play and just go show what I can really do out there. You feel me? Mm-hmm. So I feel like, uh, this fresh start is perfect for me. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I think last season in Toronto mm-hmm. didn't really go well for, for the entire team really. Yeah. Um, what do, what do you kind of feel like you can take from that situation to take to this situation and make sure, you know, like the wheels uh, don't kind of fall off here? You know, I just know it's going to be adversity. Like, uh, in your career or whatever you go through. So, I mean, that was mine just last year, not really playing a lot of like struggling or whatever, Sure. but just here, just turning my grind up more. And then during the summer and just knowing, getting back to that player that I can be playing uh, a lot of minutes, helping the team win you stuff like that. So that's what I feel like I can bring yeah. to the team. Yeah, for sure. With your brother talking to Jalen McDaniels, with your brother doing his thing in Minnesota, yeah. huge trade, by the way, going oh, yeah, on but... over there. Give us give us a look into kind of how that relationship is and with the big leap that he made last season. Are you guys in contact, you know, working out together prior to when you were in the league? And mm-hmm. and now give us a give us a look at how that relationship works. Uh, we talk like every day, pretty mm-hmm. much. Um uh, we don't talk all day, but we yeah. talk every day. You feel me? We check yeah. in on each other, play the game, stuff yeah. like that. Uh, I mean, like, when he has rough times during the season, you know, we would talk to each other, like, bro, it's a long season. Like, mm-hmm. one don't can't get hot over one game yeah. right. and right. stuff like that. So I feel like he's learned a lot with that uh, and just growing. And he's getting older. So mm-hmm. you feel me? It's like, really, I can't really say. It. Like, he's just finding his way. <laughs> yeah. You know, he asks yeah. me for stuff, stuff for sure. here and there. So I'm just uh, letting him go find his way, you know. But. Whenever he needs my advice or I need his, we you know we chop it up. Yeah. Uh, so and it's cool to have somebody going through it with you. Like yeah. mm-hmm. eighty-two games is a long season, you know. Uh, so to hit my brother and be like, "Bro, you good? Like, mm-hmm. how you doing?" And then he do the same to me. It, you know, it's helpful. So yeah, I'm sure you get asked this question all the time. Mm-hmm. But like, how how are your guys' games similar, and how where do they really kind of start to separate? Uh, really similar but different. Like I would yeah. say, like we was growing up. Uh, I was training. He had the guard skills already. Like he can already mm-hmm. like yeah. dribble, like yeah, yeah. move fluid with the mm-hmm. ball. Like that was mm-hmm. something I had to learn and like develop. So I would say that's one thing. And uh, but pretty much, I feel like it's kind of the same type sure. of game, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Talking to Jalen McDaniels, if there's someone out here or some of the Kings fans that maybe haven't seen you play before, what can they expect to see when you get on the floor? How would you describe yourself and the type of player that you are? Uh, you know, it's playing hard, playing with a lot of energy trying to be the best defender out there, running the floor, you feel me, hitting, hitting my open shots um, when I get the chance and just making the right play and playing the right way. You feel me? That's something I always just uh, prided myself on is playing the right way and just always playing with a high motor. So mm-hmm. that's just me. Being in Toronto last year, how much mm-hmm. did you kind of hear about DeMar and his, you know, as the kids say, his aura and yeah, things yeah, like yeah. that? Just kind of what yeah. kind of things he brings to the table? Uh, you know, well, out there, I remember we played him, played uh, Chicago, and they was going crazy. Yeah. You know, it was a yeah. home game, so – uh, I know what type of caliber player he is. Been sure. in the league 15 years. You know, a great vet. You know, you can learn a lot from him. Yeah. Uh, he's going to bring it every night. So I'm excited to play with him, be on a team with him. Yeah. Jalen McDaniels, great That's stuff. Right. Before we get you out of here, you mentioned playing the game with your brother. <laughs> I missed out on asking Keon about what, what games he's playing right yeah, now. Yeah, so right. I'm I'm out the game. Mm-hmm. I'm not playing games no more. What were you on, 2K? Yeah, what you, what playing, you got going playing right now? 2K, Call of Duty. Okay. Just oh, okay. Two, keep Standards, it simple. Yep. Just keep standards, it simple. Standards, keep standards, it simple. Standards, but yeah. There you go. Well, you're going to keep it more than simple on the basketball court. Yes, Jalen McDaniels, thank you so much for joining it. us, man. Good luck this season, and we'll talk to you soon. Yes, sir. Thank you. Appreciate you. That was Jalen McDaniels, one of the newest Sacramento Kings, and Thanks, we really appreciate Jalen. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, man. Have a good one.
great stuff there from Jalen McDaniels. And, you know, just I, I really liked what he said about the relationship with him and his brother. It's yeah, a long season. Great, and, you know, we talk about a lot of the the brothers, the holidays and <laughs> the, the Murray's, the Murray's, the Kupos, and, you know, it's something so unique yeah. that to have somebody that you can say, hey, this person, obviously, we have a lot in common because we grew up together right. and we're already close. But we also have something to 